Hey, good morning, everybody. This is going to be an awesome episode today. What? You getting ready? Our friends are processing chickens, and they said we could come over and help them. So that's going to be great. A um, couple updates on the inside of the house. Look, we've got some of the cabinets going in, the cabinet doors and stuff. We should get the other ones in maybe today or tomorrow. It's great. Because they don't have, like, big, fluffy clothes, and not it's a bit chillier outside, so bear with us as we um, enjoy it, and we're going to go and process these chickens. All right, see you in a bit. So we're here. Let me take this off. So we're here. We've got this um, amazing chicken plucker right here, and then we've got this uh, heated uh, water station right over here. We've also got the, the killing cones right here. It should be um, an amazing experience. I think they've got 20 or 30 more to do today. So we're excited that they allowed us to come and help. Let me show you this chicken tractor they have. This is a chicken tractor that they have. Notice this awesome water. And um, this is kind of like a Joel Salatin design. Look, they've got some wheels here to make it easier to pull. It's a little bit different than Joel Salatin made, but it looks like it would work really well. And, um, oh, that's awesome. Look at this. That's probably their feeder where you can just drop the food down right here and then have it uh have it go down there for them i love that design that's cool are you all excited are you excited are you pumped up <laughs> what do you think james so we've got a couple of them right here let me show you there are their heads they're ready i think yeah got a good cut there yeah, so we're just um, helping these chickens to turn more into meat than uh, living uh, pets here. Okay, so my dad would tell me about his mom and how she would process chickens. Her nickname was Ma'am. So she would say, okay, well, what chicken would you like to eat for dinner? And they would pick one. And so they would, she would go out, grab the chicken by the leg, lay it on the ground, step on its head, and yank and tear its head right off. This is a little bit different way of processing chickens, but I guess either way works. Okay, so the chickens have stopped flopping. It looks like they're um, they're ready for the next step. So this is water that is pretty hot, 155 degrees. That is the um, desired temperature, according to the experts. You know, you get that all the way down under there. Okay, and you got to get all the the feathers down. Wear gloves so that way you don't get uh, blisters and touching the water. And you do this for about 30 seconds, you said? So do this for about 30 seconds, and then we've got the, the plucker over there. So we're almost there. Being stuff. Okay, so let's... Um... Woo! <laughs> That is awesome. Now look at this. Hardly any feathers. Isn't that amazing? Oh, and then it's part of our job, like I showed you before, to tear this head off. Headless chicken. So that's it, folks. We processed all the chickens that they had, and now we're just cleaning things up. Um, you notice this heated bucket of water clean that up the uh, death cones right back there no more blood all that's cleaned up yeah it was a pretty good learning experience first time I've ever processed chickens so uh, yeah follow along uh, for some more stuff we'll see what else we get done today but until later party on and look for freedom